So let the carnage begin. Step into the shadows of the Hill House. You've already back at Transylvania on business. To wow, that went fast. <laughs> All right. I'm a little weirded out that there's no music. That's odd. I wonder if the sound's on. Uh huh. It's been so long that I've done, since I've done this, I forgot I need headphones. What an ass. So, yeah, we're going to uh, get going, obviously. Let's just make sure my rig is right, and uh, let's kick this pig. <laughs> That is a little loud. I don't want it to be that loud. One second. Let's see how that is. Because I don't want to be overshadowed by this. That's better. So. Whoa, fucked with the game a little there. Alright, so we arrive in town. He's actually right, but actually the first thing we're going to do is leave town. And he's one of the actually few people in this game who actually tells anything useful. But we are actually going to go out and farm another 50. We're not even sure who that is. This is the church. This is where you can refill your health. No wall meat in this game. gonna need another 50. That's why we're not gonna explore this town all the way. We're gonna go right out. Whoops. Okay, we're having trouble going downstairs. That does not bode well. Do -do -do -do. We have to farm 50 more hearts to get the uh... I can't remember what the hell I'm supposed to get other than the uh... Is the chain the chain whip is near? <laughs> Holy water! That's right, Jesus. It's only the item you carry throughout the entire fucking game, silly. This is one of the more iconic. The one thing about this game has going for it is the soundtrack. <laughs> Yeah, Dennis, they didn't think that through too well. <laughs> but I think the thing is that all of his parts were corrupting. Like, all the monsters were coming back because, like, he was still lingering. And I forgot that everything's twice as powerful at night. Uh, and you have to bring his parts back together to... Oh, boy! so you can vanquish him once and for all, quote-unquote. I also think Simon is cursed. Is that what... I can't remember the fucking story. <laughs> oh, shit. Okay, no, go away. Ah! This guy can follow me! <laughs> there we go.
It shouldn't take that long to get 50. Yeah, we're already more than halfway there. It's a peculiar choice also that your action platformer that was so successful should be followed up by an RPG-ish <laughs> open worlder where you have to gather hearts to buy upgrades. It's just weird. You can tell that they know they fucked this game up because Castlevania 3 is literally... Every decision they made in this game, they undid in Castlevania 3. Once you get on board with what you have to do in this game, it's not bad. Well, I mean, it's not great. Don't get me wrong. But it's not, like, it's not the worst video game ever. <laughs> it's just, it was incredibly badly translated. And it's a huge issue in this game. Because nothing in this game is intuitive. Everything you have to do to get, like, further on is bass backwards, and you would never do it. I... I did the red crystal cliff trick accidentally because I was so frustrated. I was just sitting there, whoa, and I was just ducking in frustration, and the cyclone got me. And for some reason, I don't think Nintendo Power did this one quickly. What are you doing there, Simon? You can ask me a spoiler, Silent Hill 2 is 20 years old. <laughs> and I am going to be finishing Silent Hill 2 in October, at the latest. I'm going to have to redo all those old videos. Come on. Kind of a zombie runs away from a guy. I will wax poetic about Silent Hill 2 for, until the cows come home. Get used to seeing that text, by the way. You know, that's another thing about this game, though. They could really have used a text speeder upper <laughs> button. Oh, wow. He is not going up and down stairs very well. Don't mind me just whipping a priest. Hey, buddy. You got some holy water? Yes, I do. Oop. Why is that not equipped? It is equipped. Weird. Oh, there we go. Alright, so now we have what we need to get to the first castle. Alright, the first, uh... Absolutely yes. <laughs> As, um, um, in fact, in every ending, yes, you killed Mary. But James is—he like blocked it, the memory of it. And since she was so sick, he got away with it. And that's why Silent Hill calls him because he's. Not only is he sinned, he isn't suffering for his sin, and that appears to be Silent Hill 2's main motivation, is to punish people who are not su- Oh, you cunt. Oh, God damn it, I knew that was coming. Uh, Silent Hill 2. Oh, every time you continue, you lose all your hearts, by the way. It's like, weird. Silent Hill 2 is very strangely, like, uh, um... It's hard to explain. It's kind of like... the t uh, Once Alyssa is destroyed in Silent Hill 1, the evil of the town is trying to draw lost souls into it to perpetuate its own evil, I think is the way they go about it. Um, also, the Order is still trying to resurrect God. <laughs> it's goofy. But yeah, you, are abs you absolutely did. The goofy thing about that is, um, 
the exposition that they... Oh, wait a minute. I gotta remember. Sorry, take the high path to the next screen. Okay. Um, the exposition that tells you exactly what happens to Mary is in the final hallway. And if you listen to the whole thing, it contributes to a bad ending. <laughs> I can't whip fucking fireballs because I'm an idiot. You actually need Vlad's rib <laughs> for that shit. Uh, you know what? We actually have to purchase a couple. We have to, like, farm a lot of... I need, like, a... How much is it? A hundred and something. Alright, we're halfway there. We're gonna spend another night outside farming hearts. Because why wouldn't you? Wow, a daytime bat? Is two slot Two shots? Or are we nighttime? I really wish there was a visual cue, other than the music. Nope. <laughs> Fuckers better start coughing up some hearts. Is this a town? No. Oh god, we so don't want to deal with tarantulas at night. <laughs> Not with this whip. Hey, we got that. I have no idea what that arbitrary health refill thing is. I'm sure it's an amount of hearts. I just don't know how it activates. I can't do this. I could, uh, you know what? I could have hit him with holy water. Would have taken eight shots, but I could have done it. The only good thing is, nighttime gives you twice as many hearts per enemy. Motherfucker. Wanting this asshole. Not the most scintillating gameplay for your sequel to your mega blockbuster action horror platformer. You know, it's weird though. On the NES, they didn't know how to do fucking sequels right. Mario 2 is that weird game. It's like the weirdest game, the weirdest, most non Mario game in the whole series. Look at that. Bat's hitbox is really low. Um, what is it? Uh, Metal Gear Solid 2 is weird. Metroid 2 on the Game Boy is very weird. Oh, god damn it. He didn't even give me a heart. It's bullshit. What do we got? Oh, we got 128 already. Shit. Yeah, so we're gonna need 150 because we gotta buy a dagger and a chain whip. Um, so we're just basically farming. Which, let's face it, was what most of us did in the NES days. <laughs> um, I believe in the good ending, James just drives away. Like, um, Pyramid Head is James's manifestation of punishment. So when he finally defeats Pyramid Head, the, when there's two of them, and they both commit suicide, it is because he has come to terms with what he did to Mary. Uh, so... There's an end, the good ending is he just leaves. With... Does he leave with Laura? I don't even know. I don't know if I've ever gotten a good ending. Because <laughs> I've just been... I I'm so bad at keeping James healthy in that game. <laughs> and that's one of the requirements. The other requirement is... Wow, we got it already. Um, uh, 
you have to do it in under like a certain amount of time that I just never really got. I love Silent Hill, but I am not great at it. Now I'm worried about it turning to night again before we get to the town. Now I'm worrying about dying. <laughs> So there's really only one other farm. Oh man, I completely forgot about this. There's really only one more farming area. You little shitbag. And they're gonna respawn. <laughs> Fuck. Oh boy. Thank God I have another life. I would be freaking out so hard <laughs> if I was down to my last life. There's something over here that I don't know if I can get yet. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> I forgot. I'm glad I remembered that. Because I think I'm going the wrong way to go to the town I need to go to. Motherfucker. At the moment, at this power level, it is... Motherfucker. It's a lot easier to just kill these, uh, to avoid tarantulas than to fight them. I hope I'm, you know, I don't know if I'm going the right fucking way. I think I am? You know, I have a guide open in the background. I should check it because I'm starting to get worried. It's, I'm about to lose a lot of parts. <laughs> All right. I think we're in the right spot. <laughs> Once I buy the chain whip and the dagger, I don't give a fuck. Uh, I watched the first three episodes of Disenchanted. I really like it, actually. Oh, shit. Garlic? Uh-oh. I fucking knew it. I went the wrong way. Well, I better buy the garlic, because there's no guarantee that I am going to survive the trip back to the stairs. Yeah, I actually really like Disenchanted. Yeah, that's what I didn't get. I guess they figured Doki Doki Panic would not sell in the U.S., because it was just so fucking weird. I better see if there's a goddamn church here. I don't think there is. I wasn't supposed to come here for so long. I mean, it's not the worst thing in the world. I can still buy the shit I need to buy here, and it'll save me time later on, but... Yeesh, I'm supposed to go down those stairs. I fucked up. This isn't even a buy anything. That was helpful. We might be in a little bit of trouble because we got a lot of hearts to lose. I really hope there's a church, but I don't think there is one here. Hey, buddy. Yeah, I did already.
fuck me sideways. All right, we got to work our way back and hope for the best. All right. This LP is going swimmingly so far. Okay. This is a DP. It's a don't play. <laughs> I'm dead. I am so dead. Those fucking tarantulas are just... Oh, I'm wondering if it's worth it just to fucking chill out and wait for day. <laughs> Shit. We are gonna lose so many hearts. Wait, it wasn't these steps, right? I think so. Wait. I think it's the next set of steps. Mother. Oh, god damn it. We're boned. Oh, look at this shit. We just lost a hundred and something hearts. Aha. These are probably the worst enemies in the game. This guy's gonna be on top of me. No hearts. That prick did like half damage. This is going swimmingly. <laughs> I'm dead. Oh, I think I'm going to die. <laughs> oh, I'm fucking just fucking. Farming hearts, just keep farming hearts. It might be worth it to go back to town and go to church. Something I never thought I'd hear myself. Oh no, that would mean crossing the bridge. We get to the town that we're on our way to to get the whip, it'd be worth it to go to church. Complicating matters, Okay. I am not at all certain. Yes, it's here. Okay. I, I think I know where I am now. Yep, this is the staircase I was supposed to take 20 minutes ago. I'm 
On the plus side, we did get garlic and the eternal flame already. Hey, buddy. I know what a rib can do. How many points? Oh, God, we only have 30 hearts. <laughs> ah, baba. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, just go up the fucking stairs. <laughs> Laurels, yeah, that's right. Okay, that sentence there is part of the problem with this game. Laurels make you invulnerable for a time. Mainly used to get through swamps and shit that, you know, poison swamps. How the fuck are you supposed to know that from that sentence? Guys are being stingy, that's not good. <laughs> Guys are being very fucking stingy. What the fuck, guys? Uh, yeah, this game has a huge amount of random invisible floors, which is why you really need to... What the fuck? You have to carry holy water with you, because it's the only way. You would think Dracula's eyeball would, would show you where the invisible ones are. No. <laughs> and ridiculously, a lot of those um, invisible flo like floors lead to death traps. Just instant death. And also, the number of continues in this game is one of the things that dictates the ending you get. So, it, this game's kind of set up for you to fail. Another cardinal sin is that there's a ton of mansions, quote unquote, which is, uh, motherfucker, um, where the items are all held. You can't retrieve an item without a wooden stake that costs 50 hearts, so you, you have to farm in mansion. There's only, I think, three bosses in the game, and they're all fucking lame. They're all so fucking lame that they repeat. You beat them, you go to the next room, you retrieve whatever part of Dracula you retrieve, and they're back. <laughs> now, mind you, this is the key sequel to Castlevania. Back in the day, nobody knew that Holy Water could stunlock every boss in the game and kind of trivialize the bosses. So, the bosses in the first Castlevania, if you don't know that, are hard as fuck. <laughs> And then you get to this game, and the bosses are laughably easy. Oh yeah, no, it sucks. There are some visual clues as to where they will be. Like, if you see pits in a platform underneath you, chances are there's an invisible floor there, and you should whip out your holy water. And, I mean, this whole part here is part of the reason why this game is not great either. Like, 150 is a lot of hearts. And mind you, you don't absolutely have to get them. You don't. I mean, you really don't need the dagger. But, if you want to do things right, you need it. You absolutely need the chain whip. Because you can't get the morning star without the chain whip, and you can't get the flaming morning star without the morning star. So it's like... Well, I'm sure some insane speedrunners have beat this game without, you know, with just the whip. 
I, I'm not doing that. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm just not. <clears throat> hey! Alright, I should get to town so I don't run out of time. I knew I was... Whoa, wait! I got hit again. I got hit twice by that same asshole. Yeah, this game makes no sense as a sequel to the game that it is. <laughs> it really doesn't. All right, that's a little more on the nose. If you equip Dracula's rib, um, it does indeed reflect fireballs if you're not moving. So once we get the chain whip, we can go to the Berkeley Mansion and get the first castle out of the way. Already saw that. town sucks. I heard sheep all day. Dracula eats them all. Also, they don't tell you. Uh, maybe they do in the guide, in the NES guide, I don't know, I don't remember. Um, that holy water disintegrates bricks. <laughs> Oh my god, the chain whip is 150. I would have sworn it was 100. Motherfucker! <laughs> How many do I have? <sighs> Your biggest enemy in this game is inflation. <laughs> uh, man, I really screwed the pooch on this one. All right, we gotta spend another night outside. Mind you, I think there's a limit. I think you can only get 250 hearts, by the way. I don't understand why he's turning around when I crouch either. I think that's a controller thing. Motherfucker. I'm gonna get a 150 and it's gonna immediately turn to night. That's for sure. I want anybody to pick up this IP. But we're getting bloodstained next year, so. Thank you, skeletons, because now I'm going to have to spend a whole night out here doing this shit. It's like, why make a random drop essential <laughs> to upgrading everything? This isn't Final Fantasy. gonna make it. Even if I got up there right now, it would turn nighttime before we got to the town. Like, a lot of NES games made you farm. Uh, Metroid is a huge example. But it wasn't this, like a necessity. <laughs> you didn't have to farm to get through a certain point of the game. Like, literally, without the white crystal, you cannot enter the Berkeley mansion. 
I mean, you can enter it, but you can't see the first block that lets you get in. I'm gonna have to put a, a like a timestamp in this video of when the farming ends. <laughs> Mind you, now they're just dropping hearts left and right. <laughs> because they're pricks. <laughs> oh, well, we'll go down and we'll just... Oh, God damn it. We'll just uh, kill some zombies until morning. Whoa, what the hell are you doing here? Oh, right through... I thought he was going to hit me right in the water. It's weird to have a uh, crow in the town. Uh, what's... Jesus, I'm getting killed here. No, what surprised me more was that it took so fucking long. Like, Castlevania's an OG... NES game. It should have been in there sooner. I get the feeling that was Konami being cunty. I don't know why, though, because Solid Snake was in. It's weird. Konami uses some of their licenses a lot more frugally than others. Holy shit. I'm not even gonna risk it. Now we're just gonna. Ah, oh, you pricks. I don't get why Konami doesn't just sell their licenses. It's dumb. I'm, my only guess is that it's some kind of merchandising thing. I don't know why I decided to move. I guess I was bored. Thank you, Christ. Now we can get going. 40 minutes into the LP, we can finally get going. <laughs> 